There was plenty on the agenda tonight for Leon County Commissioners. They made some important decisions for the county and are now waiting on an answer from the state. First on the agenda for the Leon County Board of Commissioners, accepting a deed for 174 acres of property from Blueprint 2000. That property, which is on the Alfred arm of Lake Lafayette, will connect to the J.R. Alfred Greenway as part of the Greenway Master Plan. It could also include a $715,000 boardwalk and a kayak launch. I envision a time when people are coming to visit us to ride their bikes on the St. Mark's Trail from Cascades Park or to go out to Lake Lafayette and utilize all these trails. It's going to be really exciting. The board also made environmental friendly decisions. An item on fracking received the most public comment. Constituents pushed for a resolution encouraging the state to ban fracking in Florida. It passed six to one. There are just overriding concerns about the, the water quality, the air quality, the, the general dangers that we see, and, and anything that affects part of the state can really affect all of the state in terms of uh, potential uh, financial problems that come about or lawsuits. And finally, the board passed a resolution urging state lawmakers to give local governments the power to regulate and reduce the use of plastic bags. Right now, only the state government has that power. And finally, the commissioners discussed a solution to an unsafe Leon County owned bridge on Natural Bridge Road. Commissioners decided that they will try to pool money from Wakulla and Jefferson County to build a temporary bridge until the original is restored, a project that could cost as much as $2 million. Live in studio, Jenny Gutierrez, WCTV Eyewitness News.